What's the word, everyone? It's Zapstream here. All right, so this is, I guess, third video that I bring to you with uh, the wrench. I had started this, uh, well, let, let's look at the trees here. They're coming along good, but they seem to be growing slow. I guess I have to spend more time with it or online. But anyway, um, please excuse the lag. For some reason, there's just so much lag. But anyway, I someone had suggested that I build, you know, an upstairs room, another upstairs room, um, extending outside of the house or whatever. So I decided to build this, and by the time I built the floor and the the, the stilts there, I think I'm gonna make a patio maybe underneath or something. But anyway, I had forgotten to hit record, uh, or it just didn't compute. Whatever. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to add a door there or not, but uh, I decided maybe make this a sunroom or a solarium, as some would say. Um, so I'll just work on that while I talk to you about negative people. What is it about negative people that they always have to be um, well, just so darn negative towards everyone and everything, you know, um, and I'm talking basically, well, not just basically, but most of the time it's, it's on social media and, you know, they really annoy me for some reason or other. And I think the reason they annoy me is because I don't like to be negative, but because someone like that is negative toward me or just negative in general, then I become negative. And then when I become negative, then other friends of mine become negative and then so on. It's like a domino effect. But, um, you know, and I know we're all guilty of posting up stuff on social media, you know, even on YouTube. Uh, just something negative that other people find, uh, you know, offensive or whatnot. And, uh you know, that just, but for the most part, most of us, I know that we, we try to be positive about everything, you know, and, uh, you know, we all have problems, but, uh, it's best not to just post them up online, uh, every opportunity you get just because you're angry about something, you know, uh, and of course, you know, with all these people that are just so negative all the time, I would just suggest just deleting them, uh, unfriending them and blocking them. Uh, just don't deal with their negativity whatsoever at all. And that goes as far as even in, in life, you know, you have negative people around you, just separate yourselves from them and move on. You'll find that you're a lot happier person when you get rid of these people. Now, uh, you know, as far as social media goes, I just don't put up with it. And I don't mean by, I don't, you know, because when I say I don't put up with it, I don't take crap from anybody. And I don't mean it by, well, I'll just, if somebody tells me something, I'm going to go and find them and uh, I'm going to kick their butts, you know. Uh, I don't do that, basically. I just, uh, what I mean by I don't put up with it, I don't take crap from anybody, I just ignore them. Ignore them and uh, that's it. And, you know, sometimes if I post something con controversial and somebody has their own opinion or, or the strong feelings about it, uh, I will respond to it as long, though, as long as it is a mature debate where we can go back and forth without uh, threatening each other. You know, those people I keep around as friends because, you know, if, if you can be mature about something or a, a su certain subject, then, yeah, that's that's good. Um, so, you know, basically I, I just don't understand what is it with people that wake up every single day angry and hating the world for, I don't know what reason. And if you're one of these people, you're guilty about it. If maybe something's not going right for you in life, you know, you can't blame other people. You can't be narcissistic and expect people just to like you only because other people are being successful and you can't get the same success as they do. You know, no, just work harder, work harder at it and be a positive person. Just get rid of all the negative people in your life. 
and mm-hmm. you'll realize that or if someone makes you negative, you know, even if they're positive, but you can't stand it, you, you're envious or jealous of them, uh, which is not a good trait to have. But if that's mm-hmm. the case, then just separate yourself from them. That way you don't feel that way. And that way you don't have to be such a negative person. Because pe- trust me, people will not want to be dealing with you as a negative person. Uh, by the time you realize it, you won't have any friends left. So, or anybody to want to even communicate with you or be around you. So just, you know, kind of just take that as my little advice. But you can do whatever you want. And that's pretty much all I have to say about that. And... Mm-hmm. Now, getting back to this solarium here, as you can see, I built the windows, and uh, I don't really know what to, how to decorate it, but here in this corner, I decided maybe I should just put like a bookshelf here, and maybe a little pot for decoration. Uh, I was kind of thinking maybe like a library solarium type place where you can look out and see the uh, livestock and maybe the neighbors way out, the villagers, you know, way out in the, in the distance. I don't know something if you guys have any suggestions you know please feel free to let me know uh suggest them to me and i will try and work on them as you know i i just i don't really know how many videos i'm gonna do on the ranch because it's pretty much limitless of course you know you if you play minecraft and then i'll probably start working with pistons and all that when i get more advanced but as for now i'll just do the basic stuff and like i said under this i'll probably just build a patio Maybe a walkway uh, from the front door. I don't know. But anyway, thanks for watching, everyone. I really do appreciate you stopping by, taking the time to listen to what I had to say. And I will see you next time. Zapstream out.